Hey guys, this is Liz. Um, I wanted to go over some of the things that I have that I'll be making into videos eventually, but I wanted to show you in case there's anything you want to see sooner rather than later. These have come from a variety of websites, and I don't know, I guess I'll start. These are things that just arrived in the mail today. These trio candies are from NapaJapan.com. They're green tea. I know there's more to the name than that, though. That's all that I've got listed here. I don't remember the rest, but I'll put it in the down bar. Um, they don't have any more on the website, so I'm sorry. I've also got this Pucho, I think that's how you say it. Um, this is Milk and Orange, I think. Oh, I should have wrote this all down. <laughs> Sorry. But these are candies that, they have the texture of a haichu, but inside they've got little gummies, kind of like miniature dots, if you've ever had those. They're really tasty. And I am excited to try this flavor. I also ordered another one of these Hokkaido melon flavor. Sorry. So that'll be arriving in a while. They usually take like three-ish weeks to get here, which isn't too bad for coming so far. Um, the other thing I got today are these. These are listed on the site Nere Ame. I think they're also known as Mizuame. It's like water candy. I got four of them. I'm pretty sure that the yellow ones are banana flavor, the green is melon, and the pink, I think it's strawberry. But they're fun. I'll do a video with those showing you how to do it. There's directions on the back. You use the little chopsticks that are inside here, and you put the candy on it, and they're kind of frozen right now, but it's really stiff, and you knead it, and it gets kind of, it gets thicker, and I don't know. They're fun. Because I'm thinking of doing some kind of a giveaway sometime. I don't know when. I've got to see. I've got to get some things together first and then figure it out. These little candies here, these Hello Kitty chocolate strawberry covered ball thingies. I'll just show you. These are on sale right now on Asian Food Grocer, I think. And they are like <laughs> 25 cents for this little package. Oh, they're not going to stay. But they're pretty tasty. If you're making an order there, they're worth picking up. Oh, no, but they're, it's like you get one, they send one for free when you order. I don't remember. Something like that. Some stuff I picked up at the grocery store a while ago. These, um, Chuckle Babies, I already put that one up. And some high chews. Strawberry, grape, and green apple. And a mango one, but that one I already filmed, so it's all open and not here. So. This one, too, this Apollo, I already filmed this. I have a candy here of it, you could just see it. It's this little thingy chocolate, strawberry and milk chocolate. I went on eBay and I always look for trio chocolates on there. Sometimes I have luck, sometimes I don't. These are from a seller and I'll list it in the down bar. But they're Royal Queen strawberry. I have not opened them. This person was actually really sweet. I only ordered two of these because they were pretty pricey for what they are. And on top of the shipping, it was like six, seven dollars I want to say for two of them total. So I only got two so I could have one to really try it and then have another one to film. But they sent me three and they sent me this extra milky. I'm not sure what flavor this is, so I'll see when I open it. So that was really, really nice. Um People on eBay are kind of cool about that. I had another person recently that sent me 
a Kit Kat than I made a video of. Now I'm going to get into a few other candies that I've had sitting around since around Christmas time. And I've opened them and had some of them, and but I've still got enough to review and have make little videos of. This one is Yubika from Gleeco. Glee? Glico? Oh, my pronunciation. These are just little chocolates. Um, they're in bars. They break apart in two. They're pretty good. I don't remember what side I got them on. So I will list all of these in the bar. I probably shouldn't say that anymore. You're probably getting tired of hearing it. These ones are, look, Belgian chocolate, right? Yeah, caramel and cafe flavors. Look, Baskin Robbins. These are look green tea flavors. They were on sale this morning on Napa Japan, but I think they were all sold out. And these ones, if you got a chance to order something, I would suggest getting these because they're so yummy. Um, they're strawberry shortcake? No, strawberry and cream. Look, a la mode chocolates, different flavors, ice creamy too, kind of ish. They're, they're okay. They weren't amazing. They were okay. If something is really good, I try to emphasize that so, so you know. And then these ones, these have been on a couple of sites. I actually double ordered this one because it was listed under two different names and I didn't realize it was just going to be the same thing. Um, they're good. They're, they have different kind of chocolatey fillings in them. They're not amazing. I prefer the trio chocolates to the look ones because the look are kind of waxy. Not waxy. They're probably, they have a different fat content in them probably. But they're still good. I think that's all of my Japanese type candy. Yeah. So I'll show you a couple of other things I have. I was trying to do all sorts of different um, Valentine's Day candies. And I got to most of them. One of the things I wanted to do was a bunch of different conversation hearts. Some of these are open. I already filmed them. So I've got all these different brands and types. I have some of them filmed. These four. This one I got later afterwards, so I don't know what they're like. It's kind of, I don't know. I'll do it and film it. I'll do this one separate or maybe just tack it on to the end. I, I don't know. <laughs> it, was, it was an idea I had, and it was kind of goofy. The other thing I wanted in time for Valentine's Day, but I couldn't find them anywhere, were these dark side Skittles. Because they're like, they got hearts. They're kind of like Valentine's Day sort of. Um, I wish I could have got a small bag of these, but all I was able to find was this huge one. They're pretty good. I think I'm going to make that Skittles flavored vodka with them, because I have so many. This. Gum. Ta-da. Apple pie. Extra. Gum. <laughs> and I, I saw it at the store. I said, I'm, it's either going to be good or it's going to be really gross. And it's pretty good. It tastes like apple pie filling that you get in a can. I also have Wonka bottle caps. A lot of people have told me that they really, really like these things. And I... Maybe it's like a childhood thing. They had them when they were kids and they really liked them. But... I opened this last night... And they were kind of boring. They're just pressed powder candy. They're a little bit fizzy in your mouth. Kind of to replicate a pop thing. They've got a lot of flavor. There's a lot in this box, too. I don't think I can get it under here. There's, there's a ton of them. It's like half full. It's a big box. This Wonka Nerds Rope Easter version pretty similar to the Christmas one I did. It's got different colors and it says here it's softer and chewier. Can you see that? 
new, now, sorry, now, softer and chewier. And it is, the rope part is softer and chewier. And it's good. I had, I had two of these. I already had the other one. I enjoy those. Um, these Jelly Belly Chocolate Dips. They're cherry flavored jelly beans without coating on them. You know, it's just like the center jelly part and they have chocolate on them and they were so good. I was, I was just gonna get one and make a video of it and that was gonna be it, but I really wanted to try them and I didn't feel like making a video of them and I ate them. I ate them all. <laughs> they were good. I'll have to get another to show you guys, but if you see these around and you enjoy cherry chocolatey things, you should get these. They're Lay's chips, sriracha flavored. They're pretty spicy. It's just a little bag. And I thought they looked interesting and I would give them a try. It's just a chip. It's nothing fancy looking. But I had like three of these last night and that's all I could have. They were too spicy for me. These are Christmas things that I've had laying around. Sorry, my heater turned on. That's probably adding quite a bit of background noise. But this one is a Lind, Lind Double Milk with a bear. Milk chocolate with a creamy milk filling. Sweet milk filling. Um, they aren't, I thought they'd have a soft inside. It's like harder though. Lind Vanilla white chocolate truffles. Where are they? I can't even see them. They're purple. They just look like this. And they're pretty good too. They're not great. I prefer caramel ones. But I got these after Christmas at a store half price. So that's the time to go shopping. If you're looking for stuff, go like the, to the drug stores a day after the holiday. And they have stuff for half off. And if they don't have it half off yet, ask them when they think it'll be marked down so you can just come back. Because it might just be later in the day in a few hours. You know, it won't be done as soon as the store opens. Candy cane, Hershey Kisses. These are good. They're white chocolate. They have like a swirl, like in the picture here, of red on them also. And there's little candy cane bits inside. I really like these. So maybe I'll do a thing with them. If I run out of candy, even though Easter's coming up. And I think my last old Christmas candy are these other Hershey Kisses with mint truffle. So it pretty much looks like this. Dark milk chocolate on the outside. Green in the inside with the mint. Very yummy. That should be everything that I have laying around. So if you have anything in particular that you would like to see, let me know. The thing I really want to know is websites. I'm going to leave a list down below of the different websites that I've ordered from to get candy and know of. If you see one that you've got things from or know of that is not there, please, please leave it in the comments for me so I can take a look. Because I'm always looking for different things in different places, but I, I just don't know where to look. This is my first time talking to a camera like this and posting it and I hope it isn't too awkward or I talk too fast or it's too quiet. It was, this has been pretty strange. If you want to th see any of these things sooner, leave it below. If you know of any sites that I do not, let me know. Questions, comments, concerns, reactions, and or feelings are all welcome. Thank you for watching.